Hi, and thank you so much for joining. So this is the second part of my Dollar Tree experience. I have went to Dollar Tree and I have already done three projects before. So please check out the video. I'm going to put it in the description below. This one specifically, this video specifically is about the cool, I don't even know, insects, plastic insects that I found. I'm not sure what they're for. I think they're toys but they are so detailed and so gorgeous that i thought there must be a way to present them in a very kind of um, faux taxidermy kind of way i had a few frames that i was that i used for my previous projects and i also had the school bug napkin and i had a bunch of other floral napkins that i got actually from h a couple of years ago and i thought why not combine decoupage napkins together with these cool uh, insects so of course my gold spray paint that I love and I was considering maybe spray painting these guys white but I think gold just gives it a little more glamour and they become a bit less scary looking and just become very cool here is the first of the frames so I'm gonna quickly explain how to do the decoupage so Mod Podge and I'm using the non shiny Mod Podge there are two types this one is just the matte one taking out all of the framing out of this first cutting out the piece of napkin that I want to use roughly fitting it into the frame the white frame now the first thing to do is take the napkin and separate it out usually it has two or three layers this one had uh, just the two layers this makes the napkin thinner and to it just makes it gluing a little easier Mod Podge I diluted with water and put a good layer first and now I'm gluing it right on top by the way this is I'm gluing it onto the board of the IKEA frame that I'm using uh, I'm using the board because if it's just a paper it will warp but uh, a nice thicker board is gonna keep the napkin nice and straight on the top I'm going over with again Mod Podge be careful because over here I have created a hole basically the Mod Podge should not be too liquidy but at the same time it shouldn't be too thick either because then it just becomes very hard to spread it doing the same thing for the other frame And again the same thing doing for the last little frame the only difference about this frame is that I decided to paint the board white so that the bug looks a little more lighter over here I'm going now that it's dry I'm going back and I'm painting the area especially where the napkin is missing over in white and this also makes the leaf pop and here's my gorgeous spray painted bug and a grasshopper So everything is prepared, now it's just a matter of assembly. Here is how it looks I think it looks very nice it looks far more expensive than it actually was honestly it was just about five dollars in price if you don't count all of the supplies that I used I hope you enjoyed this and please try it yourself it's definitely a fun project 
and thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share. Bye!